Mm, good day, Tragic here, and welcome to my latest tool for Tabletop Simulator. This is for blind bidding. It's just a little tool to help the bidding process. So there's a number of bidding activities in games where the mechanisms are requiring you to reveal instantaneously. Now, it's a bit hard in Tabletop Simulator to do this. There are various ways around it. Most of them use hidden zones, which I dislike. A hidden zone, if you just go to the zones, you just draw. You can draw a hidden zone, you color it to the color, and then no other person can see inside that zone. So I'm a white player. If I put the yellow thing in there, see how it disappears? And that way you can do whatever you want and no one can tell. But they're these big, ugly boxes and I just dislike them. So this is a, a fix for that well, to, to aid people. So you know those games where you say you got to bid money and you put three or four coins in your hand, you hold your fist over the table and then you all drop them on the table at once and whoever's dropped the most wins. That's what this is for. So the way it works is very simple. You just click it the amount of times you want to bid and it starts at zero. So a bid of, if you click it once, the bid is zero, okay? But if you click it uh, three times, the bid is two, okay? But what you want to do is just count from zero. The bidders will, the bid tools will like count how many times you press the button. So just press them as quickly as you can. There's no need to, you know, press it really slowly. So if I want to bid it, if I want to bid 10, I just start counting at zero. I just go zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, And I just click the button each time and boom, it's added the bid to 10. Now you'll see the readouts here says 10, right? Because I just bid, a, bid 10. That is a secret message and it's only sent to the person who clicks the button. Oh, and incidentally, uh, these buttons will only be able to be pressed by the correct colors. This is just my, in my uh, debugging mode, I can press all of them. But later on, only the, the one you download for the workshop, only your orange player can click the orange bidding tool. And it'll print out what you've set the bidding tool to in your color, but it'll only print to you because I'm white that every single one's going to be white. But if I was the orange player and I went zero one two three four five to bid five it says in the chat window you have bid five and that is only printed to me no no one else sees that and that's just so you can check your bid versus what you wanted to bid now these two buttons pop up one is r for reset and c is for confirm so if i'm happy with my five bid i just hit confirm and uh, i'll hit confirm on white to so say i wanted to bid 10 on pink i'd go Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Did I say ten? Whatever. I don't know. I, I, I can't remember what I said. So I'm going to reset this. Hit the R button, and you'll just get to redo the bid. So I'll go. I'll bid seven this time. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I'm happy with my seven bid. I'll hit confirm. And that's just the way it works. Now, if you, if anyone tries to announce the bids before all the bid tools are set, it'll just error and say, whoops, not all bids have been finalized. And that includes if they've got, uh, if they're all in the second section. So I'm just gonna set all these things to bid something. And you'll see it still won't print. Everyone has to hit confirm. And once all the bids are confirmed, you just hit announce and it will print them out in order from highest to lowest in the colors of the players. So in this case, wet red one with 15 bit, 15 bid. Now it doesn't, the, the, the tool doesn't deal with ties because every game does that differently. You know, that'd just be too hard, but it just prints out a list ordered from highest bid to lowest bid and it's hidden. And the great thing about it is because what I'm happy about it is when you click on it, it doesn't show the bid anywhere in the game. So no one can see what you've bid and it doesn't use any hidden zones. Just make sure you check the chat window that the number you want to bid is what it's telling you it's set to because you can't see it either. And that is it. That is the bid tool. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.